good evening a very warm welcome to you for the sabhyasa class so let us begin गुरु देव गतिर गुरु मेव भजे गुरु नई वसहास्मी नमो गुरवे न गुरो परम शिशुरस्मि गुरोर्मतिरस्ति गुरो मम पाहि गुरो ब्रवीमि संस्कृतम वाचा ध्यायामि संस्कृतम हृदा कुर्वे सेवांच कायेन वंदे संस्कृत मातरम योनरस संस्कृत व्योम्नि ख्यालयम रमते मुदा संस्कृतिं चैव संस्कारम विंदते नात्र संशयह सर्वेप्य हरियो Good evening and a very warm welcome to all of you. So, this is the next Abhyasa class. Before we start, just a few details on those foreign registrants who have not been able to register with Sanskrit Bharati for the Pravesha class and subscribe to the books. These are the details. You may kindly note them down. And uh, let us then move to the next uh, Abhyasa, which is exercise number seven. So, this exercise was loaded uh, earlier, uh, the week before last. I was not able to take the class last week. So, we will be covering Namapadam and Vachanam. And uh, this week, we will do the Abhyasas for whatever was taught last Sunday. Riktasthanani Urayata. So there was a fill in the blanks that was given to you, uh, which you had to do. So I request everyone who is uh, who would like to participate to kindly raise your hands. Uh, yes. Tejas. <clears throat> Tejas Mahode. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. So, will you attempt the first one? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Vrikshaha, vrikshau, vrikshaha. Excellent. Vrikshaha, vrikshau, vrikshaha. So, can you tell me what is vriksha? Is it pullinga, stri linga, napumsaka linga shabda? Pullinga. Excellent. So, it is a pullinga shabda. And vrikshau is in dvivachanam. Thank you, Te. Just kindly mute yourself. Thank you. Shaila, G. Shaila, Shaila Bhagini. Namaskar. Namaskar. So, can you attempt the next one, please? Yeah. Gyanam, Gyane, Gyanani. This is Napunsakalingam Shakta. Yeah. So, it is not Gyanam because when you say Gyanam, uh, what you are meaning yeah. is G and Y is Gyanam. Whereas this is J plus Nya. Nya. Gyanam. So it is Gyanam. It's not okay. Gyanam. It will have to be Gyanam. Gyanam. Dhanyavadha. Time to mute yourself. So the third one, uh, Krishna Chaitanya, Krishna Chaitanya Mahode. Namaste. 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 Yes. Could you attempt this one, please? Lata, late, lata, akaranta, strilinga. Akaranta, strilinga, shabda. Lata, late, lata. Dhanyavada. Uh, you may kindly mute yourself. Vatsala Jambunathan. Vatsala Ji. Namaste, Bani. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Ah. Hari Harau Harayaha. Hari Hari Harayaha. Hari Hari Harayaha. 
Yes. So, uh, Ikaranta has not been taught yet by Brindaji. I hmm. just uh, took a chance and I put it. I thought in case some discussion would have happened in the class or whatever. I have a, okay. I have, I have a doubt. Uh, can it, we can't say Hare Hey? The meaning of Hare Hey is completely different. So you huh? will learn the meaning of the word Hare Hey. There is a huh? word called Hare Hey, but it has a completely different meaning. Oh. So that Hare He, what is that word? What does it mean? You will learn about it in the Pravesha course. Okay, okay. Yeah. At this okay. point of time, we are only yeah. learning the Eka Vachana, Dvivachana, and the Bahuvachana forms. Okay. And yes, we have not covered Ikaranta Pullinga Shabda, but mm. uh, it, it kind of just got incorporated. So, uh, mm. you know, what we thought is okay, let's just see if anyone. Probably knows about it. Can I try one more? Uh, we will come back to you, Vatsalaji, because there are a whole lot of students, and okay. uh, we're just trying to cover as many students as possible. I'm sure you'd appreciate that. Okay. Yeah. So once we cover everyone, then we will see. Yeah. Dhanyavadha. Yeah. Kindly mute Thank yourself, you. please. Yes. <clears throat> Malati Murli Dharan. Namaste. Namaste. Could you attempt this one, please? Balakaha, Balako, Balakaha, Akaranta, Pullinga Shabda. Excellent. Akaranta, Pullinga Shabda, Balakaha, Balako, Balakaha. Dhanyavadaha. Kindly mute yourself, please. Uh, Shri Vidya Pratitan. Namaste, Bhaini. Namaste. So, this is the next one for you. Can you see the screen, please? Ekaranta Stridinga Padam Nadi Nadyau Nadyaha. Excellent. Nadi Nadyau Nadyaha. Dhanivadha, kindly mute yourself. Usha Narayan. Usha Narayanji. Ah, hello, Namaskaraha. Namaskaraha. So, could you attempt the next one? The seventh ah. one, please. Yeah. Ah, Vidyalayaha. Ah, uh, Vidyaleha, Akaranta, Vidyaleha, 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 That's correct. Vidyaleha, 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 Raman Subramanim. Namaste, Modi. Namaste. So, this is the one for you. Akaranda Strilingaha Rama Rame Ramaha. Excellent. Rama Rame Ramaha. Akaranta Strilingashat. Then never the head. Kindly meet yourself. Amuta Ram Amuta Ram. Namaste. Namaste. Could you attempt the ninth one, please? Yeah, Napum Shalik Napum Saka Lingashan. Napum Shanka Lincoln. Pushpam pushpe pushpani. Pushpam pushpe pushpani. Hmm? Napum saka, saka linga. Linga, linga shabda. Yes. Dhanyavad. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Gita ji. Gita bhagini. Hari yo. Hari yo. Um, uh, Gajaha stikila begini. Um, um, um uh, uh, Akarata pullingaha Gaja shabda Gajaha Gajo Gajaha Gajaha Gajo Gajaha. Excellent. Then never the kind of never the beginning. Then never the kind of you yourself. <coughs> So we now move to the next one, Pada Parichaya. So let's see what we have in the uh, Pada Parichaya. I'd request uh, Pavana Shirisha Bhagini to just hold on while I open the question. Samu Hetara Padam, yeah, kindly hold on. Samu Hetara Padam Chitva Karanam Likata. So again, what we have done is we've given you a set of words, and uh, what has been asked is to pick up the odd one. And state why is it that the odd one in the group? Yeah. 
So it's a familiar exercise which we have done earlier also in Abhyasa 6. So let's see what we have today. Yeah. Could you read out these words and then uh, complete the exercise, please? Pavana ji. Lata, 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 Shakha, Vanami, Bhasha. Lata, no. Shakha. One second. Uh, Pavana ji, you are not pronouncing the Visarga. So please pronounce the word again correctly, please. Lata, Shakha, Vanami, Bhasha. Shakaha. It is not Shakaha. Shakaha. Lata Shakaha Vanani Bashaha. Bashaha. Lataha Shakaha Vanani Bashaha. Bashaha. Lataha Shakaha Shakaha Vanani Bashaha. Vanani. Yam ad ad one. Okay. Why is lata, it the odd one? What is the, why is lata, it the odd one? Lata, hmm. Bhasha hmm. akara the three in the shabdaha. Vanam yes. Vane Vanani uh Nakun hmm. Sakalinda Shabdaha uh Bahu Vachanam Vanani. Yeah. Now what is important to note is that even Lataha Shakaha Bhashaha are also in Bahu Vachanam. Okay. All the hmm. four words are in Bahu Vachanam. But oh. the difference is that Vanani is Akaranta Napum Sakalinga Bahuvachana Shabda. Whereas the other words are Akaranta Strilinga and Bahuvachana Shabdas. Yeah, that is the difference. Dhanyavadaha, kindly mute yourself, please. Uh, Subramanyam Chandrasekhar. Subramanyam Mahude. Namaste, madam. Namaste. Uh, yeah, you have Ku the four kupyo, words. Kupyo, mm. Late, Dour, Douryo, Darvyo, 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 Ashwau. Ashwau. The Shakara should not sound like the slightly like Sir. It should not, that Sir should not come. Ashwau. Ashwau, correct. Ashwau. So, Kupyau late darvyau ashwau. Kupye late. Kupyau. Kupyau. Kupyau late darvyau akshau. Ashwau. Ashwau. Sorry. Ashwau. 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 Asala. Ash. Ashwau. Correct. So what is the odd one? Late is the odd one. Why? Kupyo the Darvyo uh, What are these? What is the these, meaning of what are what is Kupyo? Kupyo is for the bottle. Okay. Is it Pullinga or Strilinga? This is Strilinga. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, Bahuachan. Strilinga Bahuachan. It is not Bahuachan. Strilinga. What is the what is the word for one bottle? Hmm. What is the word for one bottle? Do you remember? Kupi. 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 Ah, ah, so this is uh, this is uh, ah. dual. So what is uh, ba what is bahuvachana for it? It is kupya. Exactly. Excellent. So kupi kupya kupya, which kupya. means this is. This is a Strilinga Padam and it is Dvivachanam. Now, go to, the next, huh, what, now go to the next one. Late. Hmm, what is Late? This is Napun Sahalinka. Is it? What is the meaning of this word? Late. Ashwav is for the horse. Correct. Ashwav is horse. So, Kupi is a Strilinga. Ashwav yeah. is it Pullinga or Strilinga? So, Ashwav. What is the first? What is the, what, what do you say for one horse? One horse will be? Ash, mm, Ashwaha. Mm. 
Ashwaha is one horse. So Ashwaha, Ashwau, and Bahuvachana is? Aswaha. Ashwaha. Correct? So Ashwaha is a Akaranta Pullinga Shabda. Correct? Right. Hmm? And Kupi is Ekaranta Strilinga Shabda. Strilinga. Correct. Now, now come back to Latte. Yeah. What is Latte? Lata is a creeper. Creeper. Oh. Huh. So Lata is a Strilinga Shabda. Lata is Strilinga. Yeah. Strilinga. Lata, Latte, Lata. Ha. Like Rama, Rame, Rama. Ha. Balika, Balike, Balika. Ha. Mala, Male, Mala. Ha. Got it. Strilinga. Akaranta Strilinga Shabda. Akaranta Strilinga. And it is in Dvivachanam. Yeah, it is Dvivachanam. Ha. So, Lata is a Strilinga Padam. Kupi is also a Strilinga Padam. Now go to the next one. Now go to the next one. What is the next one? Dor, uh, darvyau. Uh, so what is it, what do you think is the meaning of this word? Darvyau. It's been covered. It. Darvi is a ladle. You have a ladle oh. with which you pick up liquid, no? Like for example, uh, if you want to pick up milk or some oh. curry, liquid curry, you would use a ladle, right? It's yeah. a curved thing with a handle. It's a curved thing, a, a curved, uh, this thing with a handle, a spoon, a curved spoon with a handle, and you use it to uh, pick up uh, and serve uh, liquid items, liquid food items. So that is darvi. Hmm? So darvi, darvyau, darvyaha. It's a ikaranta strilinga shabda. It's there in e the linga chart. Ikaranta strilinga. Strilinga. So now you come back and analyze these four words. Kupi is yeah. what? Ikaranta Strilinga Dvivachanam. You would like to make yes. a note, you can do that. Yeah? yeah. Latte is Akaranta Strilinga Dvivachanam. Yes. Right? Huh? Darvi is Ikaranta Strilinga Dvivachanam. And Ashwau is Akaranta Pullinga Dvivachanam. Now you see what is differentiating? Aswau. Aswau. Because that is the only pullinga shabda. The others yes. are strilinga shabda. Strilinga. Got it? So Aswau right. is akarantaha, pullinga, divachananta shabda. Whereas the other words are strilingas and divachanas. Yes. So here it doesn't matter whether among the Skupi, Latte and Darvi, what is Akaranta, Ikaranta is immaterial. The fact is that these three are three linga and this particular word Ashwa is pulling. Got it? Thank you, madam. Most welcome. Dhanyavad. Kindly mute yourself. But it's a good, good attempt. See, what we are trying to do is we are trying to get you to understand the linga bheda. And then whether it is Akaranta, Ikaranta, Bheda. So this is the process that we are going through. Kindly mute yourself, uh, Mahodaya. And we will just move to the next exercise. So, yes. And Mary G. Namaste. Namaste. So this is the next uh, set of words, uh, which I would request you to read out and then pick the odd one out. Uh, Sarpaha, Krishnaha, Syutaha, Balakaha. Mm. Uh, Balakaha is the odd one out uh, mm. because it's a Balakaha is a feminine plural. It is not feminine. No, no, sorry, sorry. It's a masculine plural. The other ones are uh, masculine ekavachanam. Exactly. Nothing is napum sakalinga. They are all pullinga. I, uh, I said, na, oh, sorry, Punsa Karinga. I was talking <laughs> on the phone. Yeah. Sarpa, Krishna, Hasyutaha are all masculine. Punsa Karinga. Uh, Eka Vachanam. Pullinga. And it's not called, okay, the terminology is not Punsa Karinga. It is Pullinga. Yeah, it is Pullinga. Oh, 
Yeah, yes, it's not Pumlinga. Pumsaka is not. It's yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, yeah, the word is Pullinga Shabda. Pullinga but Shabda. These are, these, yeah, these are in Ekavachanam. Eka However, vachanam. Balakaha is in Bahuvachanam. Madam, Mahoraya, can you please uh, repeat that? Is it Pumlinga or Pullinga? Okay, so there uh, we we did have uh, we did come across uh, a lot of uh, pronunciation. I mean, the uh, spelling differences. Uh, yeah, and Mariji, request you to kindly mute yourself. Thank you very much. Yes. I'll just Thank address you. this point quickly. So we came across different books showing different set of spellings for Pullinga. So let me just kind of uh, share that with you because we did have a lot of deliberations. Uh, within our team also. So what happened was uh, there is often you will see this particular spelling. Sorry, my annotations are not very neat. Okay. And then there is a Chandra Bindu somewhere shown in the middle here or it is shown over here. Okay. This is one spelling, and then you will have mm, g. Okay, sorry, I'm really sorry. It's not very neat, but I'm hoping that you would be able to make out. Yeah. So this was one spelling. The other spelling that you are seeing on the screen right now is po, and then ling. Sorry, single. One second. Undo. Yeah. And then pulling. Okay. What was written in the earlier slide was pu, pum, and then with a double. So the uh, grammar rules, okay. Some places you will find this particular spelling. Also, in certain printed textbooks, we did come across this also. Okay. Now, what we have, after checking the rules for Sanskrit grammar, what we found is that these two are the only correct spellings for pulling. It either has to have a Chandrabindu and a double Lakara, or it has to have the Anuswara and a double and a single Lakara. So, these two are actually incorrect spellings. So, the earlier, uh, I think, slides and the earlier classes, this was written, uh, which is entirely my mistake because uh, I hadn't, uh, you know, checked the uh, 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 conditions and the subclauses within the rules. So, uh, there was, you know, I had mistakenly assumed that this is an acceptable spelling, but it is not. And therefore, the subsequent slides of both Brindaji as well as the Abhyasa slides uh, of the Saturday class have all been changed. You may kindly check the uh, slide deck in uh, that is given in, uh, in the course page. The spelling has been corrected everywhere. So this is the spelling standard format which we are using because the Pravesha textbook is carrying this particular spelling. So Pum with a dot. And a single lakara, lingaha, pul lingaha. However, as far as the grammar rules are concerned, there is another acceptable spelling which is optional where you write pu and the first lakara which is actually half is the carrier of the chandrabindu. And then the second lakara which is with the e, okay, is from the word linga. So then this is another acceptable spelling as far as the rules of Sanskrit grammar are concerned. So I've just written it separately only to show you this Chandrabindu. Technically, when you write two Lakaras, it is written one below the other. Okay, this is how it would be. But I am only showing this broken up like this to show you where the Chandrabindu is. So this is one clarification, which uh, I mean, I should thank uh, Pavanaji for bringing this out because uh, uh, we wanted to clarify this to you. And tomorrow also Brindaji would be clarifying this 
in her class so uh, brinda ji would also be uh, touching upon this particular thing and she would also be giving you a clarification on this but there are these are the two spellings which are acceptable as far as uh, this is concerned a uh, chandra bindu is not taught in the varnamala class because it is a little too early to cover that so uh, a chandra bindu is when you have a half moon uh, a half moon sign and a dot so this is like a it's it's a half moon therefore it's called chandra and then a bindu which gives you a sound which is similar to an anunasika sound like um uh but it is yet distinctly different uh it is definitely outside the scope of the pravesha syllabus to learn it but those of you who have gone through the vyoma a uh, course for pronunciation of vishnu sahasranama which i think brinda ji would have probably covered it and also bhagavad gita then there would be certain places where she would have certainly pronounced this chandra bindu so you would have heard the pronunciation probably uh, i don't recollect whether it was there in the printed text or not but yes like uh, shriman shriman loka traya shreya shima loka it goes like that so a yakara or a lakara etc sometimes carry this but certainly it's beyond the scope of the uh, 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 sambhashana sanskritam and uh, definitely out of scope of the pravesha syllabus which is why we are not elaborating on this in terms of the varna it is not really falling under the purview of the varna it's probably in ayogavaha i if you can go through the ayogavaha chart probably could be there i don't really recollect right now off hand but uh, that's what it is uh, we will we will come across this uh, later on and we will do that uh, no 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 uh, let's not go into uh, krishna chaitanya is asking if it has something to do with dvitva no it doesn't so we will uh, we will uh, i mean just leave this for now at this point of time in pravesha this is the spelling that we are going for uh, in terms of the word pullinga is concerned yeah so uh, vatsala ji has a doubt uh, she is she is asked what is the meaning of the word syuta a syuta is a bag syuta means a bag yeah so a cloth bag or whatever bag that you may carry is called a syuta yeah so let's then move on to the next uh, bit uh, next exercise mm, yeah anuradha s anuradha ji अनुराधाचनम स्त्रीलिंग excellent so anuradh ji i i must uh, compliment you on the way you have analyzed it and deduced it this is exactly how it has to be done you analyze oh. each word whether it is akaranta yeah. akaranta and then the linga uh, and that's yeah. so it's a practice you should start doing for all words that you come across so there will be a whole lot of words okay. that you have not yet learned but at least yeah. the words that okay. look familiar it's it's a very good approach dhanyawad anuradh yeah. ji धन्यवाद uh, uh, kindly mute yourself please yeah. so pushpe is akaranta napumsaka lingaha okay dvivachana shabdah and the other words anya shabdah are akarantah stri lingaah and again dvivachana so the differentiation has been not on the basis of vachana but on the basis of linga okay so let's go to the next word uh, priyadarshini ji could you kindly unmute yourself please namaste begini yeah namaste so could you read out the words and uh, read them uh, tell me the odd, uh, tell us which is the odd one out please 
வனானி கமலானி வனம் பலம் கமலம் அகாராந்தக நபுஷகலிங்க சப்தக வனானி பலானி கமலானி ஏதானி சப்தாக அகாராந்தக நபுஷகலிங்க பகுவச்சனம் லத்தாக ஆகாராந்த ஸ்திரீலிங்க ஏகவச்சனம் <laughs> in akaranta strilinga is just this visarga so you you realize the importance of that visarga the minute you put the visarga you are converting it from singular to plural so yes. every letter everything that we put in sanskritam in spelling is very very critical yeah excellent yes. thank you kindly mute yourself so lata yes please yes yes in one of the examples we saw balakaha Uh, mm. so if you have the balak balakaha shabdam in the pullinga shabdam then it mm. should be like balakaha uh, would be the napu uh, would, would be the bahuvachanam correct so some of the words it's difficult to differentiate both uh, pullinga and strilinga see balaka yeah yeah so you will point number 1 is that you have to first identify what is a single unit okay now uh i'll give you one or two examples so balakah is definitely pullinga because the strilinga form is balika balika so ikaranta is there however there is a word called balah balah balau balah and the strilinga form for that is bala so it is bala bale balah what happens so then when when it's bala word or bala word both for both pullinga and strilinga the bahuvachana form is the same balaha so if i were to give the word balaha it is not possible for you just looking at the word alone to be able to identify whether it is uh, pullinga or strilinga yeah uh another word that i can think is chhatrah and chhatra chhatrah chhatrau chhatrah is pullinga chhatra chhatre chhatrah is strilinga so if you look at chhatrah alone it is definitely not possible for you to make out at this point of time whether it is a pullinga bahuvachana form or a strilinga bahuvachana yes so there are other ways of finding out so we look at adjectives and then we make a guess so this kind of situations do come when you look at uh, written uh, you know uh, literature and all that so uh, there are certain things that we look out we look at what are the adjectives so sometimes we get the clue from there whether it is a pullinga or a strilinga word that's one one way to look at it uh, the other way to look at it is usually when the gender is not specified and it is not possible to make out then as a default we start with a pulling assumption so we okay. assume if chhatraha as a word is given to you by itself then as a default you will say that it is the bahuvachana form of pulling a word chhatraha but if i were to give you a qualifying thing like excellent student so when it is a boy you know a group of excellent stu- male students i would have, again that uh, uttamaha would still be difficult so uh, yeah I, i would probably look at certain other adjectives which will help you make that differentiation otherwise as a as a default you would presume, presume that it is pullinga and bahuvachana right yeah. i hope that clarifies a lot of the other things you will learn as you learn you will realize like balakah definitely balakaha is pullinga only because the strilinga form is balika, balika. there is an ikaranta so you can make a mistake over there
kindly mute yourself so that we can move on to the next question yeah so who do we have next uh dhumani ravikant dhumani ravikant namaste namaste uh yeah could you kindly read the four words and identify which is the odd one out please kakaha sukaha mm. varnam mm. mitraha mm. kakaha is um kumlingam mm. sukaha mm. is kumlingam mitraha mm. is kumlingam all these three are ekavachanam kumlinga ekavachanam and varnam is napum sakalingam mm. what vachanam is it Napumsakalinga. Vachana, Vachana. Parnam is Eka Vachana. Napumsakalinga. Okay, correct. Now, can I just extend this and ask you for. So, which is the odd one out then? You haven't still. Parnam the, is odd one out. Parnam is odd one out. So, Parnam mm -hmm. is odd one out. Just hold on. I'll, I'll, I have one more small question to ask you. So, Parnam is an Akaranta Napumsakalinga Ekavachana Shabda, therefore it is the odd one out. Whereas the other words are all Akaranta Pullinga Shabda in Ekavachana. That Ekavachana. is the odd one out. Now, my next question to you is uh, Would you be able to guess the meaning of all these words? Uh, Kakaha is a bird and Shukaha is a crow. Is a bird. Crow. Kakaha ah, crow. is a crow, crow. Shukaha is, is a parrot. parrot. Mm. Mm. Mitraha. Is, yeah, Mitra is a, mm, yeah. <laughs> Mitra is a, like a um, uh, friend. No, when it is friend, see, this is what we had explained in the in the last abhyasa as well as uh, the last uh, when we did the first class for uh, Linga and Vachana. When it is meaning friend, it is Mitram in Napum Sakalinga only. Mitram. The minute it is Mitraha in Pullinga, it is referring to the sun. S U N sun. Okay, okay, ma'am. So Mitraha can never mean a friend. Mitraha is specifically S U N sun. Okay, ma'am. Yeah. The, if you if you want to use the word to denote a friend, you will have okay. to say Mitram. Uh, Mitraha is a <laughs> Mitraha is always Radhigi. It's always the sun. S U N sun. Yeah, that's exactly why I asked for the meanings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Thank you. So the the idea is to get you to appreciate not just whether it's akaranta ikaranta. Also try and see the meanings. Also try and you know. So your yeah, we read but I forgot to uh, happens, tell happens. that. Happens. No problem. <laughs> then you have you. kindly mute yourself. Kindly mute yourself. Okay. Let's go to the next one. I'll take questions in a bit. Let's finish this exercise and then I will take it. Pungodi Hariharan. Namaste. Namaste. Could you read the words, please? Devi, Kavihi, Munihi, Ravihi. Kavihi, Munihi, Ravihi. All are pulling Ikaranta pulling. Pada yeka vachanam. Correct. Devi. Ikaranta. Ikaranta. Three linga padam. Excellent. Devi. Devi. Odd one out. Devi. Odd one. Excellent. Thank you. Very much. Very good. Devi is Ikaranta. Three linga. Eka vachana shabda. And the other words are Ikaranta. Pullinga. Eka vachana shabda. Thank you. Kindly mute yourself, please. Okay. Kalaji. Kalabhagini. Namaste, madam. Namaste. Could you read the Namaste. words, please? Ganga, Pandita, pa Pandita, uh, Yamuna, mm. Sandhya. Mm. Ganga is uh, Stilinga, uh, mm. Ekavachanam. Pandita is the is, uh, Bahuvachanam, is a uh, Pullinga word. Mm -hmm. And uh, Yamuna is a uh, Stilinga. Mm. And uh, Sandhya also Stilinga. Hmm. So Panditaha is a Bhagavachanam is, is the odd one out. Correct. So Panditaha is the odd one out because it is Pullinga, Akaranta Pullinga, Bahuvachanam. Bahu yeah. Rest Thank of you. them Thank are Akaranta Strilinga. 
ಏಕವಚನ ಶಬ್ದ ಕೈಂಡ್ಲಿ ಮ್ಯೂಟ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಕಲಾಜಿ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಥ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಯು ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ಗೋ ಟು ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಓಕೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಿ ಆರ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮಿ ಆರ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಿ ಎಸ್ ಕುಡ್ ಯು ರೀಡ್ ದೀಸ್ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ದೇವಚನ ಶಬ್ದ ಎಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಧನ್ಯವಾದ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಿ ಕೈಂಡ್ಲಿ ಮ್ಯೂಟ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ಲಿ ಮ್ಯೂಟ್ ಯುವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಸೊ ವಾಟ್ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಿ ಮೆನ್ಷನ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಇಸ್ ದಟ್ ಬಾಲೆ ಇಸ್ ಆಕಾರಾಂತ ಸ್ತ್ರೀಲಿಂಗ ದ್ವಿವಚನ ಶಬ್ದ ವೆರ್ ಎಸ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ವರ್ಡ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಅಕಾರಾಂತ ನಪುಂಸಕಲಿಂಗ ದ್ವಿವಚನ ಶಬ್ದ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಡಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಹಿಯರ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ದ್ವಿವಚನ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಮೇಕ್ ಔಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಬಾಲ ಇನ್ ಪುಲ್ಲಿಂಗ ಇಟ್ ವುಡ್ ಬಿ ಬಾಲ ಬಾಲೌ ಬಾಲ ಬಟ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಬಾಲೆ ಇನ್ ದ್ವಿವಚನ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ಲಿ ಮೇಕ್ ಔಟ್ ದಿ ಡಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಯಾ So let's finish this exercise and then I will check the uh, questions that you have raised. I can see all the questions, but uh, we'll just take it up in a, in a, in a, in a, in a bit. Manasi Devnath. Manasi Ji. Namaste. Namaste, ma'am. Namaste. Yeah, this is the exercise for you. Chishyav, Chatrav, Balav, Bale. Hmm. ಶಿಶೌ ಚಾತ್ರೌ ಬಾಲೌ ಪುಲ್ಲಿಂಗ ಬಾಲೆ ಸ್ತ್ರೀಲಿಂಗ ಆರ್ವನಿಸ್ ಬಾಲೆ ಎಕ್ಸಲೆಂಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸಲೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ಶಿಷ್ಯೌ ಇಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಶಿಷ್ಯ 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 ಛಾತ್ರ 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 ಬಾಲ ಬಾಲೌ ಬಾಲ ಆಂಡ್ ಬಾಲ ಬಾಲೆ ಬಾಲ ಸೊ ಹಿಯರ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ದ ಕ್ಲಿಯರ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಸಿಯೇಷನ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೀನ್ ಇನ್ ದ ದ್ವಿವಚನ ಅಂತ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ Yeah, excellent. Thank so, Bali is Akaranta Sthrilinga and the other words are Akaranta Pullinga. Everything is in Trivachana. Dhanivadha, kindly mute yourself. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much. Kindly mute yourself, forgive me. Amukta. Yeah, so now we go to the next exercise. Adho likhita shabdhan linga vachana anusaram vibhajya vadatu. so you have to basically classify according to the linga and the vachana ending as well as the linga and the vachana so the first word is uh, yeah amukta ji amukta or amukta yes ma'am uh, yes ma'am yes. uh, ma'am i can't understand like what i should do you have to i will tell you what you have to do is can you read the word first yes ma'am pushpani pushpani so first you tell me is it pullinga word is it strilinga word or is it napumsakalinga word it is a napumsakalinga word napumsakalinga word excellent so if it is napumsakalinga word then is it akaranta ikaranta are you able to make out that Uh, yes, akaranta it is an akaranta napumsakalinga word now can you make out whether it is in ekavachanam dvivachanam or bahuvachanam it is in bahuvachanam excellent so it is in bahuvachanam so your answer is that it is an akaranta napumsakalinga shabdah which is in bahuvachanam got it okay ma'am okay dhanyavada very good very good amukta 
Very uh, good. Ma'am, I have a doubt. Yes, please. Like, uh, I could not understand in Pushpani hmm. how I could hmm. figure out it that it is Akaranta and Ikaranta. So, how to figure out whether it is Akaranta, Ikaranta, Ukaranta? We will come to it. We will be covering it in the Pradesha course. So, in due course of time, you will come to it. Sometimes what happens is just by looking at the ending in the Ekavachana form, you kind of are able to make out. But yes, I agree. It is a little too early. So, as we go ahead with the Pradesha course, you will also be taught how to analyze it. It's definitely going to be covered in the course. Don't worry about it. So, if you find it, like for example, if I were to say Devi or Nadi, you can make out that it's E Karanta, isn't it? Yeah. Huh. But yes, in a word like Jnanam or Vanam, it looks like it is M Ma in the ending. But it is not. Why it is not, we will learn in due course of time. So, don't worry about it. After about uh, 8 or 10 classes, you will be able to make out. Okay? Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Dhanyavada. Huh? Kindly mute yourself, uh, uh, Amukta. Okay, so let's look at the next one. Amuta Ram. Amuta Ram. Yes, hey, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Namaste. Namaste. So can you read out the word and then uh, differentiate it, please? Uh, sorry, ma'am. Yeah. Can you hear me, ma'am? No, I wasn't able to hear you. Uh, could you repeat? Shikshaka, sorry, Shikshaka. 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 Okay. Mm. Hmm. Is it uh, Akaranta Pullinga Bahuvachanas? Uh, Akaranta Pullinga, you have still not learnt yet. So you have Akaranta, but you don't have Akaranta yet. Ah, okay. Okay. So it is Akaranta. Akaranta. Uh, Pullinga. What is the Vachanam you said? Bahuvachanam. Ma'am. Bahuvachanam. Excellent. So, Akaranta, Akaranta Pullinga Shabda, Shabda Bahuvachanam. Bahuvachanam Shabda. Dhanyavad. Thank, Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you. Kindly mute yourself, please. Yes. Darshani ji. Uh, Ram, Ram, Ram. Ram, Ram, Ram. So, could you read out the word, please? Uh, nakshatram. Mm. Uh, it is Akarantaha Napumsakalingaha Ekavachana Shabka. Yes, Nakarantaha. It is not Nakarantaha or Makaranta. It is Akaranta Napumsakalinga Ekavachana. Dhanyavadaha. Kindly mute yourself, please. Lalita Muttaswami. <laughs> Namaste. Namaste. Actually, I just uh, left blank this because I cannot uh, justify this. I can no see. Can you can you attempt it right now? Uh, <laughs> yes. If you are able to even attempt whether it is uh, pulling us. Okay, let's let's. Can you read the word? Uh, chitra kara. Hmm. Is it pulling? Does it look like a pulling a shabda? Does it look like a stealing a shabda? Or does it look like an apumsakalinga shabda to you? Uh, I want I want to know the meaning for that first. Chitra Karaha is a painter. Painter. The one know. who makes a chitram. What is a chitram? Oh, a chitram is a picture. Chitra uh -huh. The one who uh, makes this is masculine. No problem. Mas masculine. masculine. So for masculine, you will say pullinga shabda. Pullinga shabda. And then is it, uh, is it uh, ekavachanam, dvivachanam or bahuvachanam? Uh, bahuvachanam. Um, uh, Why do you say so? Just look at word number two. Just look at word number two, which is a pulling a bahuvachana word. Uh, yes, what do you see? Oh, oh, this is there is an uh, a, there is an uh, there is an a akara and a visarga. This is yes. not having an akara and a visarga, so it is an ekavachana shabda. No because problem. Not, not a problem. Don't worry at all about it. See, what we are trying to do is we are trying to get you to observe the pattern. Yes, so there is there is a little bit of 
pattern which we want to of course it's not really the uh, there there will be times when a similarity in pattern is what will fool you and the word will be something else but yes. still most of the most of the akaranta pulling shabdas will follow this pattern so it is an yeah. akaranta pulling yeah. shabda which is an ekavachana yeah dhanyavada okay. uh, bhagini kindly mute okay. yourself please okay. and i'm also lowering your hand right now so let's first look at people who haven't attempted so far and then we will come back to the others yeah so i request the rest of you to kindly keep your hands lowered let's look at uh, people who haven't uh, attempted even once so far uh, krishnan yoga ashwa 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 i am uh, lalita ji kindly mute yourself please yeah yes ma kindly mute yourself lalita ji you have already spoken right so i'm i'm trying to get krishnan mahoday to uh, come forward one second i lost him yeah krishnan mahoday krishnan yoga ram 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 could you please read the word ashwa hmm शोभालतामणि शोभा लता मणि राम राम भगनी राम 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 कुड यू रीड द वर्ड अलाउड एंड कुड यू टेल अस व्हाट इट इज या या सिम हा हा दिस इज पुल्लिंग हम्म बहुवचन शब्द ओके पुल्लिंग बहुवचन सो इट इज अकारांत अकारांत पुल्लिंग बहुवचन शब्द doesn't matter if you don't say akaranta at this point of time but slowly okay. you know we just trying to get you to uh, recognize yeah, yeah. the words thank you yeah, yeah. much kindly mute yourself please so this is the oh sorry sorry sudha mani सुधामणि अंगुलि कैन यू हियर मी यस अंगुल अंगुल्यः हम्म अंगुल्यः इज ईकारांत स्त्रीलिंग बहुवचन एक्सेलेंट ईकारांत स्त्रीलिंग शब्द व्हिच इज बहुवचन थैंक यू काइंडली म्यूट योरसेल्फ प्लीज हेनी महोदय Henny ji, yes. Henny. Hello, yeah. Yes, hello. Could you read the word, please, mm -hmm. Henny ji? She, she, ka, ka ha. No, no. Look at this word. Word number eight on the oh. screen. Oh. Are you mm -hmm. able to see word number eight on the screen? Yeah. Mat, mat siao. matsyao so matsyao. ma yeah. ma half the half sa and yao so matsyao matsyao so, yeah so what does matsyao mean fish on a uh, fish yeah how many is it ekavachana dvivachana bahuvachana uh dvivachanam excellent excellent that's uh, pulinga excellent masculine yes pulinga Yes, so it is an aka. Yes, yes, absolutely right. Akaranta ha, pullinga ha, and dvivachana shabda ha. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you. Kindly mute yourself. Sorry, madam. Sorry to disturb. Yeah, and uh, this sikcha uh, kaha is there. Eighth mm. one is sikcha kaha. What he got? Sikcha kaha. Mm. Yes. 
that's what we are telling but uh, next one is coming at chit uh, chatrani that's what she also told okay no i think because shikshika was repeated so i would have probably uh, uh, deleted okay. it okay, okay. it would have been repeated so, we've already covered it isn't it so oh, it yes, yes. yeah it doesn't matter oh. no. yeah okay. maybe mute yourself ah. uh, no earlier was earlier was sitchaka now it is sitchika ah uh, okay we'll i th- okay if it is shikshika then it is ikaranta uh, it is uh, uh, akaranta strilinga shabda yeah uh i think it would have then got deleted by mistake it is akaranta strilinga shabda and uh, was it shikshika or shikshika ha this shikshika shikshika then it is ekarshana then shikshika then it is shikshika shikshika dirgha vasti bhagavad then it is bahuvachana then it is bahuvachana yeah okay i think it must have got deleted by mistake uh, that's fine yeah request everyone else to please mute yourselves let's go to the next word then i think it's uh, the word must have got missed out by mistake yeah uh, atlani ji atlani ji hari om madam hari om could you read the word on the screen please chatrani hmm and it means umbrellas plural yes m kara na pun sakalinga shabda ha Uh, and it's in bahuvachana excellent akaranta napam sakalinga shabda and it is a bahuvachana dhanyavada kindly mute yourself please thank you thank you so this is the next word let's see who else is yeah lot of people thomas ji thomas ji namaste namaste so can you uh, read the word please tule hmm ಕಾರಂತಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿಂಗ್ಲಿ
Got it? Yeah. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. Not know. a problem. Not a problem. Absolutely not a problem. So a lot of times, this word you come across even in Vedanta and all because you talk about the connection between the Jivatma and Paramatma, and then you talk about this concept of an inverted tree where the roots are with the Paramatma, and we the you know uh, mortals are uh, kind of branches of that tree. So anyway, that comes in Vedanta. <laughs> Let me not go okay. there. But Shakha is a branch. And it is an Akaranta Strilinga Shabda. Here in this case, the word is Shakaha because it is in Bahuvachana. It means branches. Okay. Yeah. And never. I didn't understand how it was Strilinga, but yeah. Shakha. Shakha okay. is Akaranta Strilinga. Like Bala, Lata, Mala, Shikshika. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. These are all e yeah, three linga words. Shala, school. So Correct. you have in, in for school, you have Vidya Layaha, which is a Pullinga Shabda. And then you have Shala, which is a Sri Linga Shabda. Sri Linga. Okay. So you kind of pretty much have both. Yeah. Oh, okay. Kindly, mother, kindly mute yourself. Yeah, I would request everyone else to please mute yourselves. And uh, we will kind of take this one after the other. Yeah. So this is the next word. Uh, let's see who would like to attempt it. One second. There's some people who haven't attempted so far, so I'm trying to cover them. Padmavati Ammal. Um, uh, this also Agarantaka. First, read the word. Read the, read the word first. Bid Please bidalaha. Uh, bidalaha. So what, what does it mean? Uh, meaning, sorry, I don't know. Okay, this was covered in the class. Did you see the videos yes. or did you attend the Sunday uh, class? Uh, uh, I, I did attend the class, uh, mm. but uh, after that, I could not uh, re uh, refresh the <laughs> okay. class. Yeah, so. okay. Okay, so I would definitely recommend that you go through. A bidala is sure, a sure. cat. Yeah, a bidala. Oh. Ah, I yes, can yes, hear yes. Some now I remember. Yeah. So it's a cat and it is a pulling yeah. shabda. It is pulling, not a shabda. Uh, oh, oh. yeah. Akara a cat. pulling shabda. And it is Sorry. a bahu vachanam. Bahu not, vachanam. A problem. not a problem. So, you know, even if you are able to give about 10 minutes a day for adhyayanam, it is sure. Okay. Sure, sure, sure. Kindly mute yourself, please. Yeah, there are. Uh, let me just cover. Just a minute, please. I'm just trying to cover people who haven't spoken so far in class. Uma Devi Ji. Uma Devi. Namaste, Bhagini. Namaste. Could you read the word, please? That's Bhakshyam. Hmm. Uh, it's a Napumsakalinga word. Hmm. Akaranta Napumsakalingam. Hmm. Vachana? Eka Vachana. I think Bhakshyam is uh, related to some. Uh, food. Food. That which is edible is called bhakshya. Bhakshya. Okay. Bhakshya means that which is edible. Edible. Anything edible. which is edible. Anything which is edible can be called a bhakshya. <laughs> bhakshya. Okay. Yeah. So you, you have it in, I think, uh, Shiva Manasa Puja. I, many words. Yeah, I, mean, I remember Krishna, bhakshya, bhojya. Yeah, yeah. Bhojyam is also the same thing, edible. Same thing, word. That which can be consumed. Yeah. Dhanivadha, kindly meet Thank yourself. you. Dhanivadha, thank you. Yeah. Uh, Priya Darshini ji. Uh, namaste, everybody. Namaste, yeah. Can Chor you read the word, please? Hmm. Chorau, choraka, chorau, choraka, hmm. chorau. Akarantaka Pullinga Shabdaka Vivachana. Excellent. Akarantha Pullinga Shabda, which is Vivachana. Yeah. So can we have someone else attempt this? Can we have a few hands raised, please? Yeah. Amutta Ram. Amutta Ji. Yes, ma'am. Could you read the word, please? Darvi. Ikarantha. Mm -hmm. hmm. 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 Is it Strilinga, Linga, hmm. Strilinga, ma'am. Correct. Strilinga. What is the vachana? 
ఏకవచనం ఏకవచనం సో ఈ కాలాంత స్త్రీలింగ్ గృహాణి అకారంత నపుంసకలింగ బహువచన ఎక్సలెంట్ అకారంత నపుంసకలింగ బహువచన ధన్యవాదే తేజే తేజస్ ప్లీజ్ మ్యూట్ యువర్ సెల్ఫ్ ఉషా జీ ఉషా నారాయణన్ యా కుడ్ యు రీడ్ ది వర్డ్ ప్లీజ్ నౌకా నౌకా త్రిలింగ త్రిలింగ అకారంత స్త్రీలింగ ఏకవచన అకారంత స్త్రీలింగ ఏకవచన ఎక్సలెంట్ Thank you. Thank Can you. you mute yourself, ah. please? Yeah. And Mary G? And yes. Namaste. Could you read the word, please? Namaste. Could you read the word, please? Ghatyao, Ghati, Clock, E. Karanta, Strilinga, Dvivachana. Excellent. It's a Dvivachana Shabda. Yes, thank you. Can you mute yourself? Uh, a few more people who would like to come forward to read it. Mm, yes, Atlani Ji. Yes, thank you. Could you read the word please? Kamale. Mm. It means lotuses. Lotuses, yeah. Akarantaha napunsakalinga shabdaha jivivachanam. Excellent. Thanyavada. Can you mute yourself please? Thank you. కృష్ణన్ చైతన్య జీ ముకుంద విత్ దాట్ వి కవర్ ద క్లాస్ లెట్ ఇస్ జస్ట్ క్విక్లీ గో థ్రూ ద డౌట్స్ దట్ యూ హెవ్ ఆల్ రేస్ దర్ ఆర్ క్వైట్ ఫ్యూ హియర్ యా సో జోత్సనా జీ ఇస్ ఆస్కింగ్ ప్లీజ్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ ద నత్వం రూల్ ఫర్ పర్ణాని ఐ విల్ ఐ విల్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ దాట్ బికాస్ దర్ ఇస్ వన్ మోర్ క్వశ్చన్ ఆన్ నత్వం ఫర్ అరణ్యం ఐ అడ్రెస్ బోత్ ఆఫ్ దట్ టుగెదర్ యూ హ్యావ్ ఆల్సో ఆస్ట్ ద వచనం ఫర్ మనహ అండ్ తపహ అండ్ రాజా సో మనహ తపహ రాజా ఆర్ ఆల్ ఇన్ ఏక వచన మనహ అండ్ తపహ ఆర్ నపుంసకలింగ వర్డ్స్ అండ్ రాజా ఇస్ అ పుల్లింగ్ వర్డ్ ఓకే why they are different is because the ending is different so manaha comes from manas tapaha comes from tapas and raja comes from rajan so because of the ending that is different the uh, coinage of the word uh, the you know how the word is structured is also different natva rubal i will i will come to it uh, also uh, please clarify the nimitta letters not sure if i got the words right yes we can do the natva concepts again we will do that uh, i will also kind of mention that to uh, brinda ji to explain the natva uh, rule once again yeah bale this can't be comprehended as pullinga in saptami vibhakti uh, krishna chaitanya ji this question right now i will not uh, prefer to address it because most of the students in the class have not covered vibhaktis vibhaktis is still a very long way to go so uh, we will wait and then we will address it yeah so at this point of time we will not cover that yeah and also you have to see the context in which the word is used at this point of time when we are looking at the word in isolation we cannot uh, i know uh, that would not be the correct answer yeah hope that answers your question begini excuse me yes. uh, brinda begini has already explained twice about that natvam begini mhm okay okay but there are still questions that have been raised yes. on uh, natvam which is why yeah. i kind of uh, said that thank you very much geeta ji kindly requ- requesting you to mute yourself what is the meaning of bhakshyam i have also already covered it bhakshyam is yeah eatable edible that which can be eaten that's correct um, yeah everybody is asked about bhakshyam i think that covers it so jyotsna ji as far as the natvam rule is concerned 
uh, point number one is that you need to go through the videos yeah uh, because uh, as it was covered uh, already but i'll just very quickly uh, if required i will just go through that uh, once again i have kind of given you permission to unmute yourself jyotsna ji so are you there with me I am, but I don't remember asking that question. Sorry. It's typed in the Q and A. Uh, it's Jyotsna K. I don't know who's Jyotsna. Ah, uh, it's K. not me. Okay, धन्यवाद है. Not a problem. Uh, I think Jyotsna K. Let me try and find out where she is. Jyotsna K. G. Could you could you kindly raise your hand, Jyotsna K? I don't. I'm not able to see you here. Jyotsna K, I'd request I'll lower everyone else's hands for now, because uh, otherwise I'm not able to recognize. And I'd request Jyotsna K to kindly keep her hands raised now. So, yeah, Jyotsna K. Yeah, I've asked you to requested you to unmute yourself, Jyotsna. Namaste, ma'am. Yeah. So uh, yes, uh, what is your? No, uh, I understood Natwam rule. I just wanted to uh, double check, kind of verify, since I'm a beginner. Uh, this is. I would request you to. Huh, I would request you to repeatedly go through the videos because. Yes, ma'am. I have. I'm just with regard yeah. to Parnam and Aranyam. I just hmm. wanted to double check because uh, I'm a beginner, so I just want to make sure I understand. Not a problem. It. Not a problem. Not a problem. Parna so, becomes Parna ni. That is the nerve from uh, Tavarga. Uh, is that right? Yes. Because of the nerve from uh, Tavarga coming in between the Nimitta letters. Is my understanding correct, right? Correct. Yes, your understanding is right. And similarly, Aranyam becomes Aranyani. Is that right? Yes, that's correct. So the Aranyani. If you write ah. Aranyani, let me ah. just try. Let me just try and type it out yes. here for you. One second. Just give me a minute because I need to. Yeah. So yeah, there is a small window that's come here. So one second. I'm not able to type. Let me Anna. Let me let me try and write it with the hand. Sure. One second. Just give me a minute. Yeah. So. This is a okay, a run, a runyan, right? A runyam is your word. Yes, ma'am. Right now, yes, ma this this has already become a. Uh, yes, this has already changed. So the next n that comes here, a runyani, okay, yeah. okay. This n the 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 n is already yeah. blocking it. So this will not change. Yeah, so it will become Aranyani, right? Correct. Yes. Okay. So don't Perfect. worry too much so about. Ma'am, the Nimitta letters are R and M, is it? I mean, I'm sorry, I didn't. What I is the meaning of Nimitta? What is the not problem? What is the meaning of the word Nimitta? Ah, Nimitta means what is causing the change. Acha. What okay. is causing the causal factor? Oh. So what causes the change is. रेप, ओके, रुकार, यस, नाउ व्हेन आई से रुकार, इट इस बोथ द ह्रस्व एस वेल एस द दीर्घ, यस, वेदर इट इस दिस और दिस इस दीर्घ व्हिच आई हैव ड्रॉन और वेदर इट इस ह्रस्व, इट डजन्ट मैटर, यस, बोथ ऑफ देम आर द सेम, यस, सो नीड अ मात्रा चेंज, द प्रोनंसिएशन, या, एंड द रुकार, मूर्� Yes. These are the causal factors. Yes. When these are there, they cause it to happen. Yes. Okay. Then there is a set of words which are transparent to this effect, so they allow the natnam to take place even if they stand in the middle. Right. And then there is a set of words which block it from happening. Yes. It's like a wall. So you have a when you have a transparent. Glass light right. passes through. When yes. you have a a wall, light does not pass through. I mean, that's yes. the closest uh, example parallel that I can. Yes. yes. So 
there is a set of letters which block there is a set of letters which cause it yes ma'am yeah so so ma'am the r- r- sorry ma'am hmm. yeah continue tell me ma'am so the r uh, r uh, rakara the r and rep ha yeah all Re-pa, these are these r- all these are so all these are on one side of the block they are the causal they they causal. cause it Mm. So, man, Aranya, yeah, ma'am, said mimic the letters. So, between the repa and the, uh, the merkara, is it? Is is that the is that the way we need to look at it? So, yakara is allowed, but the n is uh, this n is blocking. There. This n yeah. is not is blocking it. So, so the mimic the letters are r and m. Is it, ma'am? Mimic the is only these three. Ah, cha cha. Okay. What is the meaning of the word mimic the? I just said it. What causes the natvam to happen? Okay, 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 okay. These words what allow it to happen? They allow okay. the effect to pass. They are okay. like a transparent sheet. They don't cause it. They are like a transparent sheet which allows okay. light to pass. Oh. Okay. This is an opaque block which will which will not allow light to pass. Oh, okay, 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 okay. This is transparent to it. This is opaque to it. Okay, got it. I mean, that's the closest parallel I can give you. Okay. If, if light, okay. I so when I say nimittam, I have hmm. a torch in my hand. Hmm. The torch is on. That is a nimittam light source. Right. Okay. If right. I keep a transparent glass, light will pass through and fall on something. Right. Huh? If I right. keep a brick wall, it will right. not allow light to pass through. That's the yes. that's. That is how you need to imagine this in your head. Oh, okay, got it. Oh. Got it. Yeah. Please go through the videos over and over again, and yes, don't ma'am. worry if you don't get this concept of anatomy at this point of time. Okay. There is still a long way to go to be very honest in the prave. As far as the Sanskrit Bharati Sambhashana syllabus is concerned, in the Patralaya Dwara Sanskrit and syllabus is concerned. natvam is elaborately de- uh, discussed only at the fourth level okay. the fourth level is kovida it okay. is only discussed there till then it is not even covered so okay. the rule that was explained to you the diagram that was taught to you was definitely beyond the syllabus you are not expected to understand it at this point of time but the reason why it was done is because this doubt will come people will <laughs> say why am i writing vanani and parnani somebody would or uh, why am i writing vanani pushpani. and satani pushpani yes, so ma'am. that is why it was covered but it is not really the major part of your pravesha syllabus yeah sure ma'am sure thank you thank you so much for taking so much time to explain not it to me